We're staying on top of that breaking news in Ottawa County, where right now crews are on the scene of a house fire. 25 News A's Steve Kelso just arrived on scene. He joins us live with what he's learning so far. Steve. Hey, good morning, Brett. We're out here in the 8,000 block of Golfside Drive. I'm going to step out of the way and let Tracy get some pictures here. It's pretty This is a fast moving fire. I don't think you can really tell the damage as well, but the entire roof of this thing came quickly. Firefighters were able to knock it down pretty quickly, and the good news is no one was hurt in this fire. Joining me now is uh, Georgetown Fire Chief Dan Hamming. Dan, it, it, it's pretty obvious that before we got here, this thing was ripping. Uh, when uh, when our crews got here a little after five, it uh, definitely had a good jump on us. Uh, uh, we had. Uh, a lot of fire around the rear of the uh, home on the deck area, uh, also extending up into the attic, uh, which made it difficult to get at. Uh, we put our crews in a defensive mode right from the get-go. Uh, as you see, we put up a couple aerial trucks, and uh, that was pretty much the only way to knock it down. But uh, as you said, nobody was hurt. That's the main thing. But uh, we're at the point now where we're going to start going in, mopping it up, and. Uh, see if we can pinpoint a cause. Yeah, at this point, it's probably too early to talk about any kind of cause. Did this uh, this fire present any particular challenges? I know you've got some mutual aid out here this morning. Well, no, just the challenges being up in the attic uh, as it was, it, uh, it makes it difficult to get at. But uh, uh, again, due to the safety of our personnel, we put everybody defensive and went at it from above rather than go inside after it. But uh, uh, like I said, a couple minutes, we'll start going back in and mop it up. All right, very good. Thank you for joining me this morning. I appreciate your time. We're going to stay out here throughout the morning and continue to bring you any updates as they're warranted. Right now, live in Genesis, Steve Kelso, 24-Hour News 8.